turn to the uh, book of Haggai now. And uh, just to set the scene a little bit so that we can understand uh, what this short book is all about. This is one of the last books of the Old Testament. It's written after the people of Judah have returned from captivity in Babylon. If you know your Old Testament history, uh, you'll know that the people of Judah had been taken captive by the king of Babylon. They had refused to follow God. They kept on turning their back on him. And despite God's warnings through many, many prophets, uh, they continued to ignore him. And as a consequence, uh, God raised up King Nebuchadnezzar to come and uh, destroy, essentially, the land of Judah and carry away um, the people to captivity in Babylon. And they're there for uh, at least 70 years until finally uh, King Cyrus uh, makes a proclamation that the men and the women of Judah can return back to their homeland. Now, you'd think that that would be the end of all their problems. Uh, Their their escape from Babylon, they're back home in the land of Israel. They've surely learned their lesson by now. And they will say, we don't ever want to go into captivity again. And they will surely now serve God fervently uh, with a full heart. Unfortunately, things don't quite work. 